The ICHQ7 Good Manufacturing Practice for Active Pharmaceutical Ingredients Guideline contains five segments, the general requirements to the applied quality system, the production, referring to topics like in-process control and raw material changes, the control governing the needs for laboratory control, validation, and change control, external contacts addressing supply chain topics and contract manufacturing, Finally, there is the chapter-specific topics defining requirements for APIs produced by fermentation and requirements to cell cultures and requirements for APIs used in clinical trials. A routine drug production differs from the production of an API for investigational use. Let's have a short look at the key differences when final drug manufacturing process is still in a developing phase. Chapter 19 of the EU GMP Guide defines that controls used in the manufacture of APIs for use in clinical trials should be consistent with the stage of development and appropriate GMP concepts should be applied. This approach reflects that requirements may change with the development of the manufacturing process. As the pharmaceutical manufacturing process is complex, it may bear a lot of risks. Therefore, another guideline, the ICH Q9 Quality Risk Assessment, is an established standard on how to detect and mitigate risk of pharmaceutical production. To perform a successful risk assessment, the manufacturing process need to be evaluated in detail. Raw materials play a critical role in the manufacturing process. Therefore, traceable information about the raw and starting materials used in the manufacturing becomes essential. Having such information already in early steps of the development of the production may reduce later risks and efforts significantly. The following information about materials used in production may present a starting point for a risk assessment of raw material impact to the drug. Information about the original manufacturer, knowledge about the validation of the release testing of the raw materials, information about the shelf life of the material, information about impurities such as extractables of used components, is the supplier capable to inform about changes and to sign a QA agreement, and finally, would the provided information be available during the shelf life of the product? With a set of documented product quality, impact assessments to reproducibility due to raw materials changes will be facilitated. Sustainable raw material information during several development phases facilitate the work of a pharmaceutical producer. Let's have a look at a collection of comprehensive information for materials used in pharmaceutical production. With the Improve Suite, we are offering a tool to hundreds of materials used in pharmaceutical production. Each product is supported with three dossiers. If you want to learn more, please go to our webpage.